Sup y'all, bring you guys another video. So, what do you guys think about the fight between Edgar Berlanga and Caleb Plant? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing. Please hit that like button. It'll help out the video. It'll help out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, um, the reason why I'm asking this question is because if you follow Edgar Berlanga on social media, on Twitter, at Berlanga Jr. Go follow him if you're on Twitter as well. He recently tweeted out this right after the uh, Caleb Plant versus Caleb Truax fight. And it reads, That fight was cute. Let me know when you're ready to get kissed by this fist. At Sweet Hands Plant. Obviously, he's calling out Caleb Plant. He's calling him out. Um... Is he ready for this fight though? Is he ready for this fight? This guy right here, King Beef. He, <laughs> he said, uh, you're an entertaining fighter, but let's not act like you fought anyone but gas station attendants so far, brah. You gotta relax. Um, yeah, if you guys don't know who Edgar Berlanga is, he is a 23-year-old fighter from New York uh, with Puerto Rican blood in him. He is of Puerto Rican descent, currently undefeated with 16 wins, 0 losses, 16 wins gone by way of knockout or TKO. He is or was considered the prospect of the year for 2020 uh, by a lot of people. In my opinion, I think he, he definitely is the prospect of the year for 2020. And, uh, you know, he did a great job in 2020 fighting three times, staying busy, uh, fighting in the bubble uh, in those three times, knocking out his opponents. All in the first round, by the way. If you guys didn't really know, all those 16 knockouts in the in, in his pro fight all were in this first round. Shows you how much power this guy has. And he's a pretty entertaining fighter, no doubt about it. But is he ready to fight someone like Sweet Hands Plant? Caleb Plant. Caleb Plant is the IBF super middleweight champion of the world. Um, you know, like I said earlier, he recently fought against Caleb Truax, outbox him, uh, boxing clinic from Plant. Plant's a very, very good boxer, uh, who's proven that he, you know, he can compete in the top. Uh, Edgar Berlanga hasn't done that yet. And to be honest, I'm liking, I'm liking the attitude. I'm liking, like, he, I'm liking the, uh, confidence from Edgar Berlanga, um, you know, it goes to show that he's re he he believes that he's ready to step in there against uh, some top competition. Um, but at the same time, you know, his time will come. At, as of this moment, Edgar Berlanga, in my opinion, is too green to fight someone like Caleb Plant. Edgar Berlanga still definitely needs to fight some big names or some at least somebody in the top 15 before stepping in there against Caleb Plant. So... So yeah, I agree with uh, this guy right here, King Beef, that um, yeah, he needs to fight some big name or at least some decent names first before stepping in there against some against Plant. Uh, let me just read some comments. Where was this energy for Benavides? <laughs> oh man. Oh yeah, this guy right here, back the bully. He's someone to keep an eye on too. But he he mainly fights at 175 though I believe. Um, you Benavides and Charlo would stop Plant easy, sickening how much they want the hope to be. They want the hope to be. True every time. Now I know why they don't want let Canelo risk losing. They are building up corny Canelo Plant fight. Canelo wins easy, but both get stopped by Berlanga, Benavides, Charlo. Man. And this guy's like, huh? How are you going to put Berlanga in the same level as these fighters? I agree, man. I mean, Berlanga, don't get me wrong. He's, he's, he's rising. His popularity is rising. If you follow him on social media, um, he has 14.6K followers right now on Twitter. That will rise. That will continue to rise. As long as he keeps going out there and winning fight after fight and winning by knockout, man... He's he's uh he's he's gonna keep rising, he's gonna keep rising and become more popular. Is this legit? Nah, it's not legit. That's him recently. He has hair. 
I don't know why I remember him tweeting this out and I was like, God damn, he's bold. But he has hair. Unless his hair grew really fast. Um, but yeah. Berlanga, Teofimo Jr., Teofimo Sr. These two will be superstars one day if they keep winning. So anyway. Yeah, two green right now for uh, Berlanga, like I said earlier. But uh, I'm liking the confidence. Um, he needs to keep it up. Just win after fight after fight. And I'm sure he, eventually he'll probably be in there against somebody like Plant one of these days. Hell, who knows? Maybe he will fight Plant before Plant retires. You never know. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for listening and watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you haven't yet. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. Please. And like always, have a great day. All right. Thanks.